Yes. Yeah. Can you see yes. the presentation? Can you see the presentation? Yes. 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 No. No. yes. Yeah. Mute yourselves, guys. Okay. Thank you. Mute yourselves. Anyways, unit one. Listen to yes. conventions. Imperative. Exclamatory. As I said, we have five types of sentences. There's four are main, and we have another kind of sentence which ha which hasn't uh, any kind of uh, subject or predicate, which is called interjection. Oh, I said, I said, okay. Okay, who is going to open the mic? I'm going to send him out. No way. Anyways, let me continue. So we have four types of sentences. We have imperative, exclamatory, and we have also declarative and interrogative. Today we are going to start with imperative and exclamatory sentences. Okay. Uh, please, boys, I can't work the same like this. Please attend on time, please. You have to come on time. I'm not going to uh, allow you after you come by 10 minutes because that's really interfering me and interrupting me. Okay, let's go back. Okay, conventions. Oh my God, I'm not going to accept anyone to enter. So, what is the imperative sentence? Listen. Don't go out and then return back because I'm not going to allow anyone to enter. Now we lost about 15 minutes just only for waiting you to enter and get in out and come back. It's not a deal, guys. It's not a way of attending a class. You have to be prepared before the class by five minutes. I prepare my class 10 minutes later. My God, it's not, it's not, it's not a way of dealing or attending any class. You have to be a little bit punctual. Okay, so let's return back to imperative sentence. Imperative sentence, it, it's a sentence that is starts with a verb and it gives, it gives what? An order or it gives a command? Again, it's a sentence that gives me a command or order and it starts with a verb. However, the verb is negative or positive. Again, so this imperative sentence. It starts with a verb. If it's uh, positive, it will be like open, open the door. And if it's negative, don't open the door. Also, it gives you a command or, or, or an order. And don't forget that it ends with a period. Yeah. Okay. Yes, okay, Abdurazak, go on. Abdurazak, move on. Yeah, what's your question, Abdurazak? No, I don't have a question, but I raise my hand. But if you ask me a question, I be ready with my hand. This okay. You are a superhero. You are very nice, Abdurazak. Thank you. Okay, now I'm going to ask you questions for. for for sure. Uh, let me choose randomly Mu'ayyad. I want to hear you. Mu'ayyad? 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 Oh my God. Moyed, Moyed, Moyed is not here. Samer, Samer, Bashar, Samer, Bashar, Samir, Samer. Yes. Yeah, hello. Can you give me an example for imperative sentence? Let me give you an example from myself. Open the door. It's an example for or hold the door for uh, uh, the, the imperative sentence. Can you give me one from your own? Uh, lock the door. 
Yeah, nice. It's uh, it's very good. Nice. Okay, Sultan. Sultan Ahmed Abdullah. Sultan? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, where are you? Oh, I'm here. Hello, Sultan. Okay, can you give me another kind of sentences using imperative? Um. Yeah, you can do it. You can do it. Just a try. Uh, Sultan, can you hear me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let me tell you a, a kind of sentence. Who is this? Uh, any sentence? Yeah, no, any sentence, just imperative one. Let's ask Abrahman al Qahtani to just help us. Abrahman al Qahtani. Hello? Speak up, man. Show yourself. Teacher, I'm here. Uh, yeah, go on. Uh, uh, arrange, your uh, arrange your room. Uh, arrange your room? Okay, clean your room. Excellent. Okay, no problem. Uh, Mehmet? <laughs> Mehmet, unmute yourself. Mehmet. Okay. Uh, okay go raise on. your hand. Raise, raise your yeah, hand. Yeah, raise your hand. Okay. I want a negative imperative sentence. A negative imperative sentence. Listen to your teacher. I need it negative. Negative. <laughs> Who is it speaking? Mehmet, okay, L let me choose another one to say it. Don't, um, don't uh, Rakan, is Rakan here? I can't find him. Rakan. No, I, Rakan, no, I you. know. Listen to you. Do, uh, do, do, don't listen to your teacher. Oh, don't <laughs> listen to your teacher. No, it's a bad sentence. <laughs> it's a bad example. Choose another one. You have to listen. Don't raise your hand. Listen to your teacher. Don't raise, don't your, raise hand. your hand. Don't raise your hand. Nice. Okay. That's okay. Okay. Nice. Okay. Where is Rakan? Is Rakan here? Is Rakan here? Mm. Okay. So let's choose Faris Ibrahim. Faris? Paris? Yes. Go on. Just give me a negative imperative sentence. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Don't open the laptop. Don't open the laptop. Yes. Nice. Okay. Thank you. Uh, uh, who else? Let me choose another one from down. Let's move down. I'm going to scroll and choose. Uh, there is a person who is called unknown user. Who is he? Who is the unknown user? Speak up. Unknown user, where are you? Speak up. Speak up. Let's keep, speak up. Speak up. Okay. I see. Can you hear me? Unknown user, if you hear me, just raise your hand. Okay, he's not here. Okay, Samih or Samih. Samih, Ahmed Samih. Hello? Just show up? Yes. Speak up, man. Hello, how are you doing? What? How are you doing, boy? How are you today? Good. Good, nice. What's your name? Uh, what's your full name? Samih or Samih? Samih. Nice, Samih. Okay, where are you from? Jordan or, or Egypt? Jordan. Okay, most welcome, Samia. So now it's your turn to tell me an imperative sentence, but in negative form. Mm. Uh, using don't or uh, just use don't. It's not. Start with don't. If you are going to make a negative, a negative imperative sentence, you are going to use don't. Don't. Uh... Mm. Mazen, don't sit here in my 
can't send you out. Wait, 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 uh, wait, Samia. I can't see the text. Khalid, Naif, and Mazen. If you are going to use the text again, the chatting, I'm going to send you out. Clear? Is it clear, Naif? Yes. I hope it's clear. Really, Mazen, don't ever talk to anyone, even Khalid. This is the last warning, bro. So once I see someone. Yeah, hello, Lamar, how are you doing? Here's Lamar and Lilian, I think. Okay, thank you. Thank you, uh, Samia. You are very good. Okay, Lamar and Lilian, can you talk? Yes. Hello. Yeah, how are you doing? Can you give me a sentence, an imperative sentence? Positive, Lilian will, will make a positive imperative sentence. And Lamar is going to make a negative sentence. Show up yourself and say it. Start with Lamar. Go on. Clo do not clo close the book. Yeah, do not clo do close not the book. Close okay, the book. it works. Yes, nice, nice. Excellent, Lamar. Now it's Lilian's turn. Go on. Uh, wait, don't 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 I talk did. without permission, please. Yeah, Lilian, go on. Open the book. Okay, open the book. Yeah, your voice is very very far. I can't hear you well. Anyways, so I think most of you right now. Okay, mute yourselves, guys, and let's return back to what we were talking about. Okay, no, 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 lower your hands, Low, hands down, hands down. Okay, so look at the examples. Open the door, close your book. Don't play in the classroom, for sure. Like Mazin and Khaled Sinyan, okay, they are playing. And even naive. Be punctual and practical in your life. You have to be practical and punctual. You have to come on time and do sessions. Okay, let's move down. Now, exclamatory sentence. Exclamatory sentence, it shows a strong feelings or tendency. You know, you have a strong feeling towards something. You see Burj Khalifa for the first time. You are going to say, oh my God, what a big tower. Or what a tall tower. So this is a way you are expressing your feelings towards something which is uh, surprising or amazing or outstanding for you. Okay, let's see some examples here. What a wonderful park. If you go to Disneyland in America, in the United States of America, in California, I think. It's located in California. Uh, who visited Disneyland before, boys? Who visited Disneyland? Disneyland short. Who is speaking? Omar, switch over your camera, yes. Okay, anyways, anyways, no problem. Sometimes you can go to Istanbul and those places in Turkey, you can find a huge, a huge parks. Even in Al-Khubar and in the Mam, you can find a wonderful park. So once you enter it, you are going to say, oh my God, what a wonderful, what a wonderful beach. What a wonderful Corneille. What a wonderful, what can I say more? What a wonderful, uh, what can I say? What a wonderful uh, mall, like Zahra Mall. You know, you know Zahra Mall, guys? Abdelaziz Tariq, show yourself up. Okay, Abdelaziz, Abdelaziz, where are you? How is Muhammad? Good. Hello, Muhammad is good? Okay, greet him. So now it's your turn, Abdelaziz, to tell me. An exclamatory sentence from your own. Do it. Abdelaziz, raise your raise your voice and let me see you. Okay, I'll see you later. Yeah, yeah, I'm waiting. 
What a wonderful Bork, another one. I need another one from your own. I have just said it. Don't cheat. Just think. What a wonderful weather. What a wonderful weather. Yes, nice. I, believe is you. I wish I can give you here uh, something like a uh, writing star or something, but there is no end here. Okay, anyways, you have got a writing star. Okay? Nice, Abdulaziz. Okay, Muhammad Yahya, because I think you are going to get mad if you didn't answer. Just give me an exclamatory sentence from your own format. Okay. Go uh, on. Yes, I will not study forever. Uh, <laughs> no, this is not exclamatory. What? What a wonderful park. What a wonderful park. What a wonderful park. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what a wonderful park. I need another one. What a wonderful car. What a wonderful but butterfly. What a wonderful butterfly. Yes. A butterfly. Do you like butterflies? Yeah, when I go to Turkey, we go to the butterfly parks. Oh my God, what a wonderful park. I want to see it. Okay, no problem. Let's move on, guys. Okay, here. Uh, we have another thing which is called interjections. Oh my God. Listen and keep attention. Unknown user. Who's the unknown user? Unknown user. You, let me let me try to link you. You, speak up, unknown user. What's your name, boy? Unmute yourself, boy. Oh, you don't have a mic. Okay. Uh, Mister, go on, go on, go on. Why do you go out and come back? Okay. Anyways, Hi. those boys who are speaking in the chat, I'm going to send them out now. I mean, I mean, because they are not respecting me. Go on. Uh, wow, uh, Sky Zone is amazing. Yeah, Sky Zone is amazing. Nice. Okay, so interjection means it just look. Listen to me, boys. It's just a word, word, or two words at least, or at maximum. I'm sorry. By an exclamation mark. It ends with an exclamation marks. It's a a group of words or only one word, okay? It shows also an emotional feelings like, oh, yikes, my God, yucks, hurry. You know, those kind of words that I use in order to express a feeling. If you are disgusting, you are, you say, yuck, it's not good, the sandwich, okay? If you feel a pain or, or something, you are going to say, ouch, my head, my leg hurts me. If you see, uh, if you are going to shout for one of your friends, you are going to use Okay, look at here, let's sum it up. First of all, an imperative sentence, it gives you a command or may make a request, okay? We know it. Open the door, please uh, close the window and so on. It's a kind of request or command. It usually begins with a verb and ends with a period. It usually begins with a verb and ends with a period. The subject to you is not shown. Here, in that sentence, you are not going to see the subject. It's hidden here. For example, let me show you. Open the door. Here is a hidden. Can you see, boys? Can you see what I'm typing? Yes. OK. Yes. So, so here we have a hidden subject, which is you. You open the door. It's a kind of calling. You open the door. You close the box. You don't play uh, in the classroom you be punctual and practical in your life so we are using it okay so let me continue okay so i i'm using here a heaven kind of subjects it's not showing an exclamatory sentence shows strong feet or surprise. 
It ends with an exclamation mark. An interjection also shows a strong feeling and ends with an exclamation mark. An interjection is a word or a group of words, not a complete sentence. Imperative sentence. Look for elk in the wood. Yeah, elk is a kind of animals here. And exclamatory, the squirrels were all swimming. Oh my God. And interjections like, wow, ouch, oh no, hurry. You know, those kind of interjection, you have to know it. It ends with an exclamation mark, but it just one or at maximum two words, not a complete sentence. Okay, it's time to practice. Who is ready to work with me now? Who's ready? Just raise your hand if you want to answer. Just raise your hand. I want all your hands up. I need to see all your hands up. Uh -huh. Who wants to answer? Who wants to answer, guys? Uh -uh -uh. Boys? Yes, okay. Abdullah Rida Kamal. Nizar Abdurrahman Pahtani. Yeah, yeah, raise your hands up, guys. Raise your hands up. Raise your hands up if you want to answer. If you, if you want to answer, just raise your hands up. I need all of you. I want to know that you are here. You are not asleep. Go on. Okay, Omar Hassan, you break the laws, so you are out. Okay. Lace, why you enter and go out every time? Okay, I need hands up. Who wants to answer? Just raise your hand. Just only four or five who wants to answer? Who wants to participate? Nizar, why did you leave? Anyways. Okay, raise your hands up. Sultan, raise your hands up. Yusuf, Abdurrahman Qahtani, Yasin, Yamin, Wissam, where are you? All of you, just raise your hands up if you want to answer. Hadi, welcome Hadi. Okay, now let's start questions. Question number one, read, let's read the, these directions. Read, read each sentence, write C, if the end punctuation correct. Write NC or not correct, if the end punctuation is not correct. Okay, Seaman, what was that amazing dog? Is it clear or not? It ends with a question mark. Is it clear or not, boys? Who can answer? Let me choose. Uh, Lamar, can you answer? Lamar, number one. Yes. Me. Me. Yes. was amazing. Yeah. Is it clear? Is it correct or not? Seaman. Seaman was an amazing dub. Yes. Correct. No, it's no. not. Look, it ends with. A question mark here. It it has to be ended by a period. Yes. So it's N C. Yes, it's a period. It has to be ended. So it's not correct. It has to be yeah. It has to end by a period. Okay. Who can answer number two? Let me see. Let me choose another me? one. Mazin. 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 Don't see me. Mazin. Can you hear me? Yeah, raise your voice. I can't hear you, man. Okay. Raise your voice. Okay. I'm very... What the boat along the shore? Is it correct or not? What did you say? Number two, bowl the boats along the shore. Can, can you see? Can, can you see the, 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 uh, the slide here? Can you see it? Yes. Okay, number two. To answer it, pull the boats along the shore. C. Okay. Yeah, it's C. Nice. Load the equipment in the first boat. Who can uh, answer? 
Uh, let me see Yasin. Yasin, well, this is the first time for you to speak up. Go on. Yes, Mister. Go on. Go on, Yasin. Not correct. Yeah, not correct. It has to be ended by a follow stop or a period. Yes. Okay, thank you. Okay, only three beavers built for this fine dog. Mm, I think this is a declarative. You have to put it, it's not correct also. You have to put it just only full stop. Cross the river upstream. Yes, what can we say? Is it correct or not, boys? Who can answer? Khaled Thniyan. Khaled, Khaled, what's your name? What's your full name? I can't... Uh, I can't spell it. Khaled Mishal Thwini. Sorry, again? Khaled Mishal Thwini. Okay, Thwini. Okay, Thwini. Okay, no problem. Sorry for misspelled it. Okay. Uh, number five. Number five. Can you answer it correct or not? Yes. Um, NC. Yes, and see, it has to be a period, not an exclamatory mark. True. Excellent, man. Okay, uh, number six. Who can answer it? Abdelaziz Tariq Arabi. Where are you? Abdelaziz, you felt asleep? Yes. Yeah, where yeah. are you? Okay, I wrote yeah. down or uh, uh, write a word or a phrase that will make the sentence as a sentence is that kind of name. Here we are going to make it an exclamatory. So what can we write? It's the largest dog I have ever seen. That. You can. Oh, oh, that oh. is the largest, yes. Uh, no, that, that, that is bitter. You can write that, it's bitter. Excellent, man, excellent. Let's choose another one for number seven. Sorry, Abdul Mahdi. Where Abdul Mahdi or Adil Mahdi? I don't know. Where Where are you? Okay, let me choose from the. Abrahman Qahtani, go on. Teacher. Okay, make it imperative. Make it imperative here. Number seven about the adventures of Lewis and Clark. Hmm. Go on. No. Lower. Sorry? No, read. No, you can tell, tell us. Tell us about the adventure. You can say, just tell us about the adventure. Okay. I can't hear. I say you can say, tell us about the adventure of Lois and Clark. Okay, I need another one to answer. Let me go down and choose another one randomly from those. Ismail Wakar Hamid. You're not. Hello? Yes, go on, Ismail. Number eight, make it exclamatory. Tip the boat. Hmm? Mm. What tip the boat? You can hear to make an exclamation. What tip? You can just write what. Okay, Do number not. nine. Do not. No, 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 no. I say what? W H A T. Uh, let me choose someone else. Abdullah Rida, Abdullah Rida Kamal, where are you? Abdullah yes. Rida, okay, where are yes. you? Where are you from, Abdullah? Uh, from Egypt. Yeah, most welcome, my friend. Okay, number nine, it's yours. Make it imperative. You can do it, Abdullah. Okay, don't stay on the don't stay on deck. 
Yes. Okay. Don't stay on deck. Nice. Yeah. It works. Anyways, guys, that's all for today. Uh, tomorrow, there's no live sessions to be ready. You have to work uh, according to the timetable. And if you are, are going to answer the homework, you have to copy it. Okay. And be ready for uh, sending me using the email here. Look at here, guys. Use compose and then send the message. You are going to use compose and, and then do. After that, you are going to find. Just wait, listen, 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 listen. listen. Because I have no time, I have a session after you. Okay, and then send it to yeah. one of the teachers. Okay, for example, me, and that's all. Okay. Teacher, okay. what's the homework? Thank you. Wait, what's the homework? The homework, what is the homework? Teacher. You are going to open listen, weekly plan for the first week. Listen, listen, listen. Listen to me. You are going to open the weekly plan for. for uh the week one and answer all the homework related to it okay week one all and week two we we are going next week we are going to start week two with week three we are going to make integration in order to cope with and not miss any and don't miss any one okay 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 anyways bye guys see you later bye. have a nice day bye. Bye. Wait, i'll ask you a question first bye the homework you sent uh, go on, go on. the last time, uh, I didn't know how to uh, do it. Okay. I, I said just at the timetable, you have the weekly plan for week one. For week one, answer the homework that are mentioned there. If, if you have something, just PM me using what? Using, uh, using the OBIS system, and I'm going to answer you, okay? Uh, okay. Thanks. Bye. Okay, bye.